This is Collector's Night 2015, and it's a night when we invite collectors of all sorts to one room to share in a tabletop display their obsessions. Um, and for us as a museum that focuses on New York City history, it gives us one night where it's a wild card. Anything goes. My collection is taxidermy and entomology that I've collected for many, many years. And I'm also uh, kind of dabble in making. I guess I'm an amateur taxidermist. I've been collecting film prints like this for about 15 years. I have films like this going back to the 1910s. So uh, some of what I have is over 100 years old. The people could buy projectors or rent projectors and have these little, um, we call them home movie film prints. <laughs> this is my original one. I have brushed his hair a lot, so it's almost gone. He's sort of getting a receding hairline. <laughs> so I think he, this was my inspiration, this guy that went on the top of a pencil. I started collecting pizza boxes because I run these tours of famous pizzerias around New York, and so I get people who come and take these tours from all over the place, and um, one day I mentioned that I had this tiny collection of 20 pizza boxes, and then people started bringing them, and now they come to a tour, and I gotta take like 20 pizza boxes back on the train on my bike, and it's a pain. I love the graphics of the lingerie macaroons, and just to say that I'm a serious collector, I do have an itemized list. <laughs> the matchbooks in the back there, along with the haunted skulls back there, and then it's fun <laughs> clacking matchbooks. It's very like something very America about it because it's easy and it's free. In second grade, I was weird, and the kids loved me for being weird because I would trade any football player, great football player cards, for someone with a weird name. And I was an easy mark. Um, but I stuck to my guns and I've stayed with collecting and collecting weird stuff. I, I, I can't have Picasso. I, I, I'm a museum worker. Um, but I want to play the game. The emphasis is not so much just on civic pride and preservation, but just on how important the notion of collecting in general is as a tool for education and um, preservation. We have been fortunate enough to meet some incredibly interesting people, some, some characters and some people that just, they're so passionate about their interests that if there's nothing in common with the actual artifacts that they share with other people, their passion for it is shared. And that's sort of the link uh, that combines um, all of the interests in the room.